Two storms are looking to make back to back landfalls along the Gulf Coast this week. So that's why sandbags are piled up in Mississippi and Louisiana, bracing for Marco today and Laura then right after. So let's get right to meteorologist Natalie Ferrari this afternoon to track the tropics for us. How does it look out there, Natalie? Yeah, good afternoon, Allison. Still tracking what it is, Tropical Storm Marco and Tropical Storm Laura, as of the 11 o'clock update from the National Hurricane Center. Uh, storm surge warnings lighting up a good portion of southeastern Louisiana through Mississippi this morning through this afternoon. And then you see Tropical Storm Laura just grazing along the southeastern coast of the Cuban island there. So let's take it out to Tropical Storm Marco, moving to the north-northwest at 8 miles per hour. It really got into a hostile environment to where it kind of helped to weaken this system as it got close to the coastline within the past 24 hours. Still aiming for the southeastern Louisiana coastline by tonight. And it will, it will pretty much deteriorate rather quickly as it takes a sharp westerly turn riding along the coastline there and even heading the remnant low of it towards east Texas. Now, Laura continuing to move to the west as well, west-northwest at 20 miles per hour. This one is forecast to actually really gain some steam as it makes its way across the Gulf of Mexico, likely intensifying to a Category 2 storm. Naturally, we will see some moisture associated with these systems being close by, but still are far enough to where we don't expect any direct impacts. Really, it's going to be some breezy winds and some rain for us here today and tomorrow.